The town of Wyndham is on edge tonight, waiting to learn if one of its biggest employers, the High Life Foods pork plant, will be closing. This afternoon, the State Department of Agriculture visited the plant about 150 miles southwest of the Twin Cities. Morgan Wolf has the latest. High Life Foods sent out a warning to their employees that they could be losing their jobs if they don't find someone to buy this company. There has been a lot of corporate turnover here at this plant for the last decade, but it is a true staple of the community. Wyndham, it's your typical, like, cozy little town. Around Town Square. I'm surprised. Yeah, I was really surprised to hear that. You'll hear the talk around town. Been around for a long time. High Life Foods has been trying to sell their Wyndham plant, and if they can't, a thousand and three people are out of jobs. They bought majority of the stake in the company from Glenn Taylor's Taylor Corporation in 2020. It's become the largest employer in the city. Yeah. From one business owner yep. <laughs> to another, Andy Harries knows that the economy is presenting challenges. We can't just be the local cafe that everybody would like us to be because we have bills. High Life reported inflation, grain prices, foreign exchange and operational losses as struggles leading to this situation. In a statement sent to CARE 11, the CEO says we want to sincerely thank our team. This is an extremely hard week and we are unquestionably sad. It does bring a lot into the community. The plant roots date back to the 50s. Definitely taken effect. It's had a big impact on this small town. I guess we'll see what happens. Layoffs could begin as soon as Monday and last through June 2nd. And the company says even if they do find a buyer, they're acknowledging that the new owner may still want to reduce the number of employees. I'm Morgan Wolf in Wyndham for CARE 11 News.